What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. Alonzo, and it's your boy. Young Batman, you already know what it is. We out here dropping buckets. And today we are coming at you guys with a 360 way tip video. This is for the OGs, but most definitely this is for the beginner waivers. We are gonna throw tips at you guys that we feel have not been brought out into the community, the wave community, 360 wave fam. You know what I'm saying? Um, and also stuff that we wanna, you know, touch back up on that you guys probably, you know, forgot about or haven't been doing because we in the wave groups, we see what y'all been doing, you know what I mean? And I'm not gonna get y'all wrong. Yeah, you know I mean, I just started waving again, but you know what I mean? I know what I'm doing, and I'm gonna show y'all later, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, go ahead and tell them, man. Appreciate it. Yes, thank you for having me. So, yeah, we're gonna talk to you guys about tips for getting waves. He's a 360 waiver, I'm a 720 waiver. We're both coarse, so we thought it would be a good idea for us to collab, talk to you guys about what we do to get our waves because we're both coarse, and this will target, like he said, OGs, new waivers, and also help those that have coarse hair and any texture. But I do often get a lot of questions from coarse hair waivers because it's very difficult at times because uh, your hair over curls and the hair is really what we call nappy, but in coarse. So therefore we will, you know, we will give us a little couple of tips and tricks some things that may work for you, some things that work for him and work for me, should work for you too. And uh, yeah, let's get it. Now, what I wanna get on is brushes. I wanna get on what brushes to use real quick, man. So this is a real good tip for the beginner waivers. This is not for the OGs right here. Or, yeah, I mean, this is most definitely just for the new waivers, you know what I'm saying? Um, for those of you who are still asking what brushes to use, when you guys are getting waves. Um, you guys are always gonna want a soft, a medium, and a hard brush. You know what I'm saying? If you guys really don't have, you know, a lot of money, you know what I mean? Make sure you get at least a medium, you know what I mean? Something that has some pool that you can brush with when your hair is low and when your hair is, you know what I mean? Getting thicker when you're wolfing, you know what I'm saying? But if you really want to be elite and you're really serious about it, you guys are gonna wanna have to have a soft, a medium, and a hard brush. Now for me, I recommend in soft brushes, I'm gonna go ahead and let you um, show them what soft brush you'd rather than use. But for me as a recommendation, I actually, I prefer a Diana. So the soft brush that I recommend is the Diana 8119. Here it goes right here, y'all. This is the one that I use. Yeah, you know I mean, this is ex exactly what I use for my waves, as y'all can see. I just got done using that, as a matter of fact. We gonna go ahead and get a little mini brush to in while he talking, man. Well said, yes. I see you, bro, I see you. While he brushing, um, talking about the, talk about the medium, talk to you about the soft that I like to use. Um, I definitely use uh, you definitely, like he said, you want to start with a hard brush when your hair is at a thick length so that you can uh, get down to the scalp and then your medium brush. And the soft that I like to use is the Pink Torino Pro. I don't remember what number this is, but yeah, this is the pink one with the very long bristles, very soft. This I use, this can, I use this at pretty much most every length to lay the hair down, it's a very good polisher. But yeah, you definitely wanna have yourself a hard brush. And before you start using a hard brush, you wanna make sure your hair is at a heavy length. You know what I'm saying, it's your woofing. And also, knowing your hair texture, that all comes into consideration, whether you're a coarse hair, medium, or straight hair. So therefore, a hard brush is gonna be targeted towards woofing, as well as coarse hair waivers, when you have enough hair. But if you don't have that much hair, use your medium and your soft. And I'm gonna get a session with this too. Get this going. I did just come from the gym, so hair's a little frizzy, a little something. And uh, I, just, I was combing it out. And uh, I'm just gonna, you know, hit it with this soft right here. And uh, yeah, let them know what's good. And then we're we'll, we gonna get a session at the end. 
All right, so look, one thing I do want to bring up though, I do want to bring up shower brushing and over curling, you know what I'm saying? When you guys um, are over curling, when you guys are wolfing, I want to make sure that I want to tell you that you guys should have a comb and you guys should shower brush. When you guys are shower brushing, you know what I'm saying? You guys need to have a- Yes, very good point. Shower brushing is definitely important. Also, keeping your hair clean is really important too. You want to take advantage of your shampoo using healthy products that's going to um, help your hair grow at a heavy pace. And like he's about to say about combing, yes, combing is really important. That's going to be used to line your waves up, to get down to the scalp. And while you're wolfing, letting your hair grow to a heavy length, you want to make sure you're combing and hard brushing. Like I'm at the point where I'm doing a lot of combing to line my waves up because I'm you know going after a very hard pattern which is the 720s uh, excuse the frizz I'm gonna wash after this uh, I'm gonna do a washing style basically using the shampoo and rinsing it out with the cap and then you know letting your hair I'm gonna, I'm gonna wash after this and basically that's pretty much that so yeah make sure y'all comment like subscribe Thank you, Mr. Alonzo, for having me. We're going to get a brush session in together. And uh, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, comment. If y'all want us to do any more collabs, you know, let us know. Make sure y'all subscribe to Mr. Alonzo and subscribe to Young Batman. We got a lot of content coming for y'all. Most definitely, I got more videos coming for y'all, brush reviews, etc. Mr. Alonzo, he rocks out on Fortnite. You know what I mean? He plays Fortnite. Come rock with us. We about to get a session with y'all. All right, y'all. Get y'all brushes out. Get y'all combs out or whatever y'all using. Come on, get a session with us.